Hey YouTube, it's your girl Laferette and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we are going to be doing something peculiar. It's something that I've seen on Instagram and a little bit on YouTube but it hasn't really caught on yet. So I tried it once on wet hair and the results... It didn't come out as how I'd like it to come out. Um, I think I put too much gel or something in there, but we're gonna try it again, but on dry hair. I saw this one girl on Instagram. I'll try and find her Instagram again and link her down below. She did it on dry hair, so I said, you know what, let me try it out on dry hair instead. Hopefully, second time's a charm. So the product I was talking about was this bad boy. It's called a Pico roller I think that's what it was on the packaging I threw it away so yeah don't even ask <laughs> so this product has holes at the larger end which should be used to aerate your hair it's supposed to allow your hair to dry better it's made of uh, plastic or rubber so I'm not sure how good that will be but today's product we'll be using is the Vercorol mousse <laughs> I saw a girl on YouTube use this for a dry rod set and it came out good for her and she said it's supposed to dry your hair quick so I said you know what let me try it out it guarantees a super hold enriched with argan oil it creates super silky shiny curls and eliminates frizz this bad boy better give me what I need to get these curls tomorrow so if you want to see me try this product out please keep on watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're new all right let's get on with the video as you can see here i'm working on blow dried hair i'm working on a video on that and stay tuned to my channel to see how i got my hair to look like this so i'm just gonna section off my hair because as you guys know i love working in sections it just makes it a lot easier for me also guys i just want to apologize for the sound i got a new camera lens and the autofocus is killing me right now i got around four packs of these so hopefully it'll all fit or all work with my hair and each pack i think if i'm correct each pack comes with 12 is it 12 it might be a little bit more and it comes with the different sizes this is the bigger one and then a smaller one. So I'm guessing it's supposed to make your hair have variety. I'm gonna section off this bad boy right here. So I'm gonna section off this some more. All right, with this mousse, I'm not gonna use too much because I need it to dry by tomorrow. So I'm gonna just use this amount. Make sure the ends are well coated because I don't want any fraying ends. And then I'm gonna start off with a small one. So I'm gonna roll it at the ends and then roll it up just like a roller. Then when I get to here, I'm just gonna flop this part over. And there you have it. And I'm just gonna repeat that step all over my hair. Take the mousse. Make sure you get the ends properly coated. And we're gonna take just a bigger one just to see what it looks like. And wrap it around the ends, make sure the ends are smooth, and then roll it up. And then that's it. It's pretty easy to do, like really, really, really easy. Yeah, so we're at the top. I have this amount more to go. I have five more. Hopefully, this is enough because your girl doesn't have any more. <laughs> Make sure I coat the ends and then gradually work my way up to the top. So I'm gonna take this. Make sure the bigger portion is facing up so that you're able to cover the hair correctly and it's just more sturdier for your hair. Then you're gonna wrap it around and then roll up. As I said, this cup at the top, the bigger part, and then roll all the way up. Then all you're gonna do is latch it over. And then we're good. All right, 
white so my entire hair is covered this is what it looks like I'm gonna leave this in overnight and you guys will see the final look hopefully second time's a charm <sighs> and we are back it's been about a day and a half maybe a little bit more and I'm ready to take these out again sleeping in these are like a dream compared to like flexi rods oh my gosh Thank God for these. Hopefully our second attempt is a lot better. I have somewhere to go today, so this better work or else a girl's gonna be home. <laughs> okay, we're, we're good. Y'all. Y'all have no idea. You guys have no idea. Oh my gosh. Rods where? Flexi rods where? So I got a little excited, I'm so sorry, but I'm gonna explain to you guys how I took it off. It's so, so simple. It took me like about seven minutes tops to take out everything. So all you're gonna do is flip back the large portion or the bigger of the two sides. I'm gonna flip it back and then just unroll it. It's that simple. And we are done. What? Am I tripping? This is like salon curls. I haven't had curls like these in such a long time. And I don't even want to like separate them. How nice they are. Like, I just want to leave them be. <laughs> but we gotta separate. We gotta, we gotta show out. No, no, no. So we're gonna use extra virgin olive oil. This should reduce frizz. I don't wanna put too much because I don't want here to be oily. So we're just gonna coat our hands with olive oil and just separate. When you're separating, you wanna recurl it back the direction it was curled. So then again too, you wanna make sure you get your hair where it naturally separates for as less frizz as possible. So I'm only going to separate it into two because I'm scared. And here we are, our final look. And uh, this is what the back looks like. guys no let's unpack this this is amazing this looks great like what i don't have to use a flexi rod again fully endorsed although we had our first fail um i don't want to remind everyone but um yeah it wasn't a good situation but my hair is nice bouncy fluffy yo shout out to this mousse i need to read a commercial for this mousse <laughs> and this China, China, you're coming for me. Wish, wish, you're coming for me. This is gorgeous. All right, so guys, stay tuned for my final thoughts. All right, so cons. Because this is plastic, it doesn't aerate very well. Even though it does have holes in them, it still doesn't aerate very well, especially if you're gonna use gels and all that. If you're gonna use a gel, you would have to use as little as possible if you expect this to dry in time. I've seen people go under the dryer and it didn't work well for them. They had to re-go and re-go and then the gel flakes, so be careful with that. And also too, the fact that I had to blow dry my hair first, pretty much stretch it out first and then then put these in it was a bit of a hassle like it took me a longer time than I would have expected but the pros let's get into this once you have the moisture correctly this bad boy is 
easy to use you only need one thing and it's just this you don't have to add anything twizzle around anything all you gotta do is bend it over and you're good to go sleeping in this was a dream compared to like flexi rods sleeping in this was a dream because when it clamps over there's a lot of surface area here so when you're laying down it doesn't feel that hard and because it's rubber as well it's not hard it just makes it a lot easier to deal with when nighttime comes i don't enjoy doing my hair where i have to try and sleep on my arm i know there's no way but this one i barely slept on my arm and finally need i say more look like this action that's going on right here i love it i'll definitely use it again hands down this will be my go-to curling anything now your girl has another hairstyle she can rock all the time <laughs> all right thank you guys so much for watching remember to like comment and subscribe if you're new i enjoyed doing this video although we had a fail over the weekend that had your girl in depression but nevertheless i have personal beard and we have our curls and don't worry i'll link everything that i use in the description down below so i'll see you guys in the next part remember to check out all my social media accounts it's a at at snapchat instagram and twitter all right enjoy the bloopers this thing seemed to not have con caught like i cannot and here we are god damn